Okay, this is my 436 HP scanner, and um, I'm going to mess around with close call. Now, close call is exactly what it is, close call. You have to be close to somebody's radio, if somebody's driving by in a car, in a car uh, it might pick it up. Um, at a construction site you have to be pretty close if you're walking around the neighborhood or a city uh, it just depends now what it depends on is very simple the frequency that it's going to pick up has to be stronger than the background noise in the air so if you're in an area where there's a lot of background noise um, you're not gonna get a hit on close call I always have close call running uh, it's called C close call do not disturb CDD and what will happen is if I get a hit because I have an outside antenna I usually get a train or an aircraft flying by uh, or an ambulance or something uh, it'll kick in and I've got it set for 10 seconds so the audio will go for 10 seconds then it'll sh go back to scanning and then it'll kick in again if uh, somebody's still talking now it's pretty simple to set up you go over here to the lower button press it go down the close call hit enter now that's close call only okay close calls on now it's working little thing jumping up and down there that's how much noise there is now these are your bands zero one two three four five six well which is which see the three number three I'm gonna press number three and shut it off and really quickly it'll tell you what band it is okay 137 to 225 band on off now if it's off then can't get any close calls now if I go to band six that's 758 to 1300 so you can turn that off there's a little X there shows you that it's off turn it back on now what that's good for is I mean if you're looking for stuff in a certain band and you want to shut off all the other bands then that's cool shut number two off that's 108 to 137 that's the aircraft band now I pick up a lot of stuff because I have close call hooked up to my outside disc on antenna I pick up trains I, I pick up aircraft out of Buffalo New York out of Niagara Falls New York flying all over the place um, but with a little rubber ducky antenna as I said, depending on the noise in the air um, will depend how much you're going to get with close call. If you're in the city walking around and there's a lot of noise in the air, uh, chances are you're not going to get too many hits. But the closer you are to the radio, like if you walk by a construction site and they're talking on a radio, well, you're probably going to get it. everybody's different uh, sometimes it works better for other people now I'll show you what I have on here if I can without messing everything up see what I got up here I've got a little trap it's an FM trap and that knocks out the FN band and I find that I get a lot more hits because it clears up the background noise 
Now, I don't know if it'll work for you. You can get these on Amazon.ca, Amazon.com, electronic stores, and it's just an FM trap. But ever since I put it in, I pick up aircraft flying around, I pick up, tra I pick up trains, it just works better. It cleans up the uh, background noise. Uh, they're only a few bucks. You may want to give that a try. Um, I've got really good um, luck with close call now. Um, as I said, I have it hooked up to the outside antenna. I go to Niagara Falls, Ontario. And I walk around, and it's always going off. Always. Not lately because of COVID-19. But uh, once that's over with, I'll be going back to Niagara Falls and St. Catharines, Ontario. And I always take my scanner with me, and I turn on close call, and I always get hits walking around. Uh, if you're walking through a, a department store or Walmart or just walking around. Uh, you'll pick up some stuff. So that's about it. Let me back out of here. Go here. Enter. Now, hit switch scanner. You can set your stop avoiding, temporary avoid, whatever. If there's something that it keeps on hitting on, all right. Let's say you're walking around and it keeps on locking on to a frequency that's just noise. Hit the avoid button. Hit it once or twice. Okay? CC mode, again. Uh, I've got it on CC D D and D because I like it on all the time when I'm scanning. It's do not disturb. Now, if I just want priority, I'll put it on priority. Okay, or I can shut it right off. Your alerts, uh, tones, whatever tone you want to put in there, uh, lights, try different lights. There's a light down there. Okay, set the lights. Now you pause. When it gets a hit, you set it. Uh, I set it for 10 seconds, usually. And then it'll go off the frequency after 10 seconds, but if somebody's still talking, it'll kick back in again. If you don't want it to do that, then you can set it for infinity. And that's about it. Um, sometimes you'll get good luck with it, other times you won't. As I said, it depends on where you are and how much background noise. The thing is, the frequency has to be higher, stronger than the background noise. You see this popping up and down here. Oh, let me turn that back on. <laughs> two, I think. Yeah, two. Okay. Three. It's a little bit of noise in there. Uh, I'm surprised I haven't got a train or anything. Or a plane coming into Buffalo. It's 10.30. Oh, I didn't get lucky. So to get out of that close call, you just hit the lower button and system. And it goes back to scanning. And you can see down here, I've got close call on. Do not disturb. So, if I get a hit on close call, it'll break in. And I'll hear it for 10 seconds. That's about it. Um, give it a try. I hope you get good luck with it. And uh, enjoy your scanner.